Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. As I was sitting here, a song came into my head and the song was, Where do I begin to tell the story? And that's all I remember of that. Where do I start? Okay, that's enough of that. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. It's like, I don't know where to begin. I'm going to show you today. Today, we did get some sunshine, so I'm back. Yes, we got the sun. A little bit of sunshine came around. And the dog was very excited because he stands in the, in the brightness of the sun. And I stand in the sun, too, and it warms. It's amazing how warm the sun makes you feel. And I let the chickens out. You're going to have a little picture. You're going to get a little little snippets of videos in this video. You're going to see the chickens again. But I want to show you, I'm going to show you, and that'll be in one of the little videos. The other day I went out, yesterday in fact, I went out and got the eggs that were laid. And there's a really, really tiny egg. The one egg that um, Jim said was the size of my olive was not the size of my olive. I will show you that one. But I did compare it to an olive. This one is the size of an olive, just about. And then I show you with a quarter and a nickel. And I show you with a, a little cap that comes off the half and half jug. You know how small those are. And I, so that you can sort of see a comparison. And then I show you the peewee egg, the egg that he thought was the size of an olive. And then a regular size egg. I probably should have put the jumbo egg with it, but I didn't. And I'm going to show you how I cook the egg. I had the grandchildren here. I had two of them today. And because um, I went to the dentist to go pick them up so that, believe it or not, Paige wanted to go back to school. What kid wants to go back to school? Well, she did. So I brought her back to the school, and then she got off the bus here. And when she got off the bus, she wanted, I said she had the choice of hot dog stew, because that was left over. And she goes, do you have eggs? And I said, I have eggs. And so she prefers to have the eggs on bread. So I'm going to show you the fried egg on bread. I didn't show you the full process, because I didn't think of it, and I was doing it. And Paige helped me with the camera. So, And you will see her take a taste. And then she said to me when I was done, I thought you weren't supposed to show kids. And I go, well, this is not really a kid video. It's just talking about food. And I don't think anybody will mind. I'm hoping. You won't be my thumbnail, that's for sure. So, um, and then what else did I do? That was it, I think. Yeah. Is that Kyle playing the... The iPod, oh, and, iPod. well, because I asked him if he wanted his egg the same, and I kind of shined it on Kyle. So you will see Kyle playing the, the iPad. And when the iPad was down to 20%, he says, can I go home? <laughs> as soon as the electronics are low, they want to go. And I said, no, nobody's home. You have to stay. So she stayed. And about 20 minutes later, his mom came. So he was... He was fine. And then he kept saying he wanted to go. And she says, I'm not ready to go. It's funny how the kids, when they're, when they're not finding things that they want to do, they want to hurry up and go. And so he stayed for a little while. And I played Cat's Cradle with, with um, my one grandchild. And she didn't know how, but she does now. And I did a couple magic tricks again. I did the one around the neck, and they thought, you know, kids love that. It's, they find it fascinating. I did the hand one, and then I did one with the nickel and the pennies. and But I do show them how I do the trick so that they can practice and do it and amaze other people. But they're not supposed to tell anybody, but I tell them just so that they know. Well, I guess that's it. Yes? Yeah. We're done. <laughs> We're done. Okay. Well, I'll talk to you all again tomorrow. Have a great day. Bye. I just went outside to give the chickens their food and I found an egg. Look at this egg. It's the size of my olive. The other day Jim thought that the egg was the size of an olive, but that one wasn't. That one was big. This one is the size of this olive. It's just a green olive. To give you another example of how small it is, I just put the cover half and half container so you can see that. 
Look how itty bitty, I'm just amazed. I guess I'm not done comparing. There's the size of a quarter, and there's the size of a nickel. The nickel fits the olive, the quarter fits the, and then there's the cover. So small, so cute. Whoops, I don't want to get it wet because I don't wash the egg, but that's so cute. It's just, I missed the bird that laid it. I thought this egg, I don't wash my eggs as you can see until I go to use them, but I thought this egg was little when we got it. But compared to that egg, this one's tiny. And this egg is of regular size. So there's the eggs. Everybody's waiting. I'm coming. Hi there, Emma. You're always doing a little dance. Back and forth, back and forth. Back up, girls. Come on, let me in so I don't step on anybody's feet. You ready for the scratch? You ready? Here it comes. Here, chick, 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 chick. Oh, don't be snapping at her. It's okay. I'm gonna throw the rest of it in your house so you have something to dig at later in the day when you get locked back in. Oh, and your Emma's back. Emma's in here. She says, oh, there's good stuff. Hello, ladies. Hello there, Lady Jane. There you go, Emma. Enjoy. Wow, you got a fluffy back side of your feathers there, pretty boy. Okay, today Paige and Kyle have asked for fried egg sandwiches. And this is how I thought of this after I got started, but this is how I start them. I put them on, I put the egg in there and then I put the bread on top. And then I take the bread and the egg and I flip it over so that it can kind of cook a little bit on the other side. And then this is what it starts with. It starts with, I start with two eggs and I beat them. Look how orange the yolks are in these. I had put salt on this so that there's already they're already salted. Then I'll take two slices of bread and I put it on the on the egg. Okay, here hold it again, sweetheart. I've got Paige helping me. Just hold it there. We're gonna take it out of the pan. And we're gonna put it in the dish. We're gonna take it and then you just slide it into the dish. There it goes. And that's her, that's her um, egg. It's two eggs, two slices of bread. And she's going to eat it. When the kids come, they like their food cut up. And if you have kitchen shears, these are just regular shears that are used only in the kitchen. And what I do is I cut their food with it. It makes it so much easier than trying to use a fork. And so I will cut it for her. Kyle, you want to turn your game down, sweetheart? Just take the volume off for a minute. Oh, and I should turn the radio off, too, come to think of it. Oh, there's so much things going on. Mute. Mute it. Okay. That's better. Well, anyways, you cut the food up with scissors, with your house, with your food scissors. And it makes life so much easier and faster. What do you take on your eggs? What do you want? Syrup and ketchup. You want syrup and ketchup? You want both? Okay. I will get both for you. Want me to put it on it or do you want to dip it? Dip it. Dip it. Okay, so just a minute. And then 
because she likes to dip her ketchup. I put a little bit in a dish and she likes to dip syrup. I'll put a little bit of that in the dish next to it. And the smoke detector goes off. Okay, you go ahead and have a taste. You need taste. something to put, my oh, put your gum on the edge of your plate. That'll be fine. Okay. And, oh, you don't need a fork? Just trying this one. Just trying that one. Okay. We're going to let you be seen, okay? And she's going to eat it. How is it? You're getting watched while, you're, while you eat. You're, <laughs> she is getting it's watched good. while she It's good? You like it? Okay. How about you, Kyle? You want the same thing? Kyle. I like just syrup. Just syrup? Okay. And he's over there playing a the game.